this is not all it's cracked up to be. Nothing's as relaxing as watching deadly explosions of fire. Ah. Oh, 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 this is it. Here comes the boom boom. Hold on to all your butts. Already on it. Yeah. Let's get this party erupted. Ha -ha. Nice. Oh. Man, total lava letdown. Never underestimate Mount Fit to Boom. <laughs> Intense? Huh? Wow! Uh, uh, Gretcherson! You had me at binoculars. Oh, that, that line! I, I know that line! Yes! I mean, it's just our favorite movie of all time! <laughs> when when crime, crime is too far away to see, it's, it's time, time to, to get, get some, some binoculars! binoculars. Uh, Will you look at that, sweetheart? It seems as if we've got some fans. Only your biggest fans? You're our favorite action movie star couple! Huh. I'm the Gritchison's biggest fan. I even have a tattoo. It's on my body. Stay out of their sight, Armand! We don't want to scare the humans. Oh, please. What's so frightening about us? Right. Not that we're complaining, but why are you guys visiting Camp Lake Bottom anyway? To see our precious daughter, of course, Gretchy Kim. Gretchy Kim? <laughs> uh, yeah. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. And then there's this. I sleep there. Those are Squirt McGee's bunks. That's a shrunken head. Spider eggs, the usual. Interesting. It smells like the set of Invasion of the Mold Men from Mars. What? Welcome to Lake Bottom Macaroni Lays, our tradition. Yeah? Since when? Well, let's see. Since super awesome movie stars started coming to our camp. So, today? Oh. Mickey, could you give it a rest? Oh, don't worry. We're used to it, dear. Make sure you get my good side. Where is that music coming from? We had sound systems added to our formal way. It just made sense. Okay, Gretch, what is the deal here? You are embarrassing us in front of your parents. Oh, and speaking of that, why didn't you tell us? Oh, come on, Gretch. Me and Squirt live for your parents' movies. Like Double Black Belt Shark Tap Out 4? Or Double Black Belt Shark Tap Out 5, the re-sharkening? Come on. Both classics in the giant shark versus human genre. Sorry, personally, I can't stand all that Hollywood nonsense. Whoa, nonsense? What are you saying? <laughs> and that's what you get for invading the White House. Ah, oh, now that brings back memories. Did you know that shark had a black belt in Taekwondo dorsal fin? Dad, Double Black Belt Shark Tap Out 5 was just a movie. Can't we all talk about real people stuff? For once. Real people stuff? Gretch, we talked about this. Stop giving your father frown lines. If I didn't know you better, I'd think you didn't want a visit from your action stars. Uh, you mean parents? No, that's exactly what I said. Oh, happens every time. <sighs> Did someone call for parent participation? Stand up straight, dear. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. I'm patented by my own folks. Aw, oh, there, there, Gretch. I'm here for you. <laughs> <laughs> wow! That was just like spin kick and spin kick party six, Mrs. G. My turn! <laughs> Best spin kick inflicted in turtle rupture ever. That's it. I'm so out of here. <gasps> oh, what's with Gretchikins now? <coughs> hey, this is just like the set of Killer Cop Cloud Five. <laughs> <laughs> Gretchy Wetchy, is that you? <coughs> Can I get an autograph, a lock of hair, an extra kidney, perhaps anything? I'm your biggest fan! Okay, this is 
gonna be just like the final scene in Spin Kick Party 6. And, oh, and don't be afraid to go for the Gritcherson eyeball crush. You got it! And watch out for the Gritcherson larynx twist, too! Guys, stop! Have you seen Armand? You know how fan crazy Armand is. I hope he isn't chasing after the Gritcher's pants. Oh, don't worry. The Gritchersons can totally handle one crazy fanboy. <laughs> Gritch's folks are running scared. Straight from out fit to blow. And it's fit to blow. Oh, now I get it. Oh, the Gritchersons? Scared? That's impossible. They played every kind of hero that's ever existed. That's it. Squirt! They must be researching roles for a movie! Come on, remember how scared they pretended to be in Giant Gator 7? <laughs> You've been accessorized! <laughs> Come on, Squirt! Those two acting geniuses are gritchersoning it to the hilt! And we're missing it! Mom? Dad? Here we go again. Huh? Oh, see? I told you the Gritchersons could handle fanboy Armand. Uh-huh. Looks like a textbook Gritcherson larynx twist to me. Actually, I slipped in a puddle of the Gritchersons' fear snot as they were desperately running away. <gasps> and all I wanted was a few pics of them for my celebrity scrapbook. According to Gritchopedia, the Gritchersons practice kung fu yoga, don't eat pineapple, and poop 400 times a year. But it never said anything about running from fans! That's because it's acting, Squirt. If we split up, I bet we can find them before they wrap. <laughs> That's Hollywood talk. Come on! <laughs> Ran whatever that was. Time for a peace spot check. All clear. You too. Oh, nice work, dear. There you are. It's dinner time. <laughs> well, don't you want any of my famous stone soup? <laughs> Sorry! I loved you guys in Screaming Zombie Stompers 3D. Oh, how ironic. Get it off me! Get it off me! Ah! <laughs> Look, it's Gretchen Kids! Gretchen Kids! Gretchen Kids has come to save us! Gretchen Kids! <sighs> Please, get us out of here. So, it's true? You weren't just acting scared? But but you wrestled sharks! You, you fought mutant gators! You crashed a jet to get here! <sighs> Guess it's up to old Gretchenkins to set the story straight again. Oh, I don't do slimy. Stunt double! <laughs> you knew this whole time? Sure. You sent stunt doubles to all my birthday parties because you didn't trust the candles. <laughs> <laughs> Easy, guys. None of this would have happened if you acted like normal parents, even if you are the world's biggest cowards. You're so right, dear. Oh, Squirt, look at me. We can still love their movies, right? Even if the Christiansons are the world's biggest cowards. <laughs> no, we can't. Ah, uh, yeah. Can't. Now, let's go before Mount Fit to Blow explodes. You can act not scared better than anybody! Okay, I can do that. And action! Thanks for saving us. Oh, and by the way, I did notice you borrowed the rescue scene from Lava Luau the Third. So 
though you have seen your parents' movies, Gretch. Oh, only like a trillion times. See, I told you, you could act not scared better than any... <laughs> This is so going in the scrapbook! Dear Mom, thanks for the visit. Sorry you had to grow so soon. Leave me alone! Actually, Susie, I think you mean leave me alone. Get it? <laughs> Note to self, lettuce has no sense of humor. Green vine, meat, black belt. <laughs> Little bro in for the big sister save! <laughs> Jumping geraniums. My pot plant must be my green thumb. Or it's all that irradiated latrine slurry I've been feeding it. <laughs> <laughs> And green. <laughs> Music soothes the savage fern. So do power tools. <laughs> Save from being crowned, little Miss Plant Food. Oh, and you're welcome. Oh, and for what? Chipping my nail? I am so telling Mom and Dad. <gasps> Treachery! <laughs> it's okay, she's kidding. Because not even Susie would... Hey, that's our song! Was our song till you wrecked our act. I'm Susie. I'm McGee. We're, We're McHappy happy as, as can be. To sing and dance together, together like, like one big. <laughs> um, it was an accident. <laughs> really, really funny. You won't find it so funny, because this means Mom and Dad are visiting today. They are coming, and when they see this freaky camp, you are going. <gasps> I can't believe Susie could be so evil, mean, nasty, vindictive. There's only one word I care about right now, and it's stop my sister. Okay, people, Operation Parent Proof is a go! Sawyer, hide your spare parts. Rosebud, cook something normal. Squirt, animal control. Let's play a little game called Hide and... Actually, it's just called Hide. And I shall impress your parentals with my impeccable plies. Um, sure. As long as it's from your super secret hiding spot. What? Why must I conceal myself? Fine. But just remember, you're missing out on this. You ready to fail? You ready to fall? So this is Lake Bottom. Daddy! McGee's being mean to me! Oh, I'm sure he didn't mean it, Peanut. After all, you're family. Oh, I want to squeeze you till your heads pop off like dandelions. Yeah. Why did you get so huggy? <laughs> <laughs> Say, where's the rest of the gang? They're dying to meet you, too. <whistles> Mom? Dad? This is everybody. Not everybody, McGee. Where's Armand? Um, gone fishing? All right, cheetah pants. Do you have any queens? A pleasure to make your acquaintance, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Please, call us Mom and Dad. <gasps> you bet. Put her there, Dad. Oh. <laughs> the old removable arm prank. <laughs> Classic Sawyer. Honey, Sawyer knows the secret gardener ratty handshake. <laughs> You're like two peas in a pod. <laughs> really? Okay, clock's a ticking, everyone. And we want you to see everything. Oh, they'll see everything all right. Lake Icky Gloomy. Ugly name, but beautiful, totally non-toxic lake. Something smells fishy here, and it's not just Squirt's breath. <laughs> 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 
Mm. I can't believe how full of nutrients this water is. Everything you need to grow big, strong, and green. Don't you mean healthy? Of course. What did you think I said? Uh, speaking of a totally different topic, who's up for lunch, huh? But, Dad, didn't you see the... I like your parents. They're weird. Ugh. Here's your mac and cheese. Ah, cheese! Where's the regular food? <laughs> ah, the monster! Oh, it's just Gretchen's face. Uh, My bad, sees dig in! Harold, this food is... Totally gross, right? The most delicious thing I've ever put in my stomata. <gasps> stomata. Italian is such a beautiful language. Are your parents usually this, um... If by, um, you mean surprisingly cool, then no. But I'll take it. Next on the tour, the outhouse. Our usual post-lunch stop. McGee! This trail is lovely and secluded. Yes, you could scream and scream and no one would hear you. <laughs> <laughs> if you were McGee's parents, that would sound totally creepy. But you are, so it's not. What is wrong with you people? This place is so gross! Zombies! <laughs> <laughs> now that was zombie beautiful. Ah! Ah! Dad, don't move! But why? Because I gotta get a picture. <laughs> Say coconuts. McGee's parents used to be weird, but now they're kind of strange. Yeah. Uh, 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 a rose butt butt? Welcome to the family. McGee's real parents. We gotta warn McGee. <laughs> this ride I'm thingy is delightful. <laughs> no one is this lucky. It isn't luck. They actually like Lake Bottom. How cool is that? If you think they're so cool, why don't you cool off at home where everybody's so cool? Cool? Oh, cool it, Suze. I'm gonna chill here no matter how frosty you make it. Stop making ice puns. Go home. No, you go home. You go home. You go home. I said it first, go home. No, you go, go home. home. I'm not even listening to you. Mickey, I, 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 I know you can go hear me. Go home, go home, go home, go home, go home, go home. Those two sure can go at it. <laughs> well, one sec, Mom and Dad. Gotta show these pesky pod plants who's boss. <laughs> Sorry, Sawyer, but we can't let you prune our plants. Go home! Uh, Stop uh, yelling uh, in my uh, beautiful uh, ears! Uh, 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 Time to flesh out our family tree. Oh, absolutely, Sweet Pea. I've had my chlorophyll of those two. Jack off the stuff in a woodshed, cause I can't pass the human balloons. Take it away, Vinny. Come on, Vinny. If you don't take this seriously, how are we ever going to get signed? Oh! Ah! I should have sung the greens instead of the blues. Oh! McGee, you're such a child. <laughs> Don't you ever notice your eyes go were crossed? Home. Is that weird? Your e oh, your ears are big. <laughs> Kids, come join our big happy pod family. <laughs> mom, Dad, what are you doing? I don't think this is the real mom and dad. <laughs> <laughs>
adopted our own family. Really? Well, why didn't you just say so? Aw, our little baby peas. <laughs> Come on, Suze. Let's give the new family their time in the sun. <laughs> Sue, Mom, Dad, fun visit? Um, I'm not sure. It must have been because the day just flew by. <laughs> it feels like we just got here. And now you should be leaving with McGee. You have to take him home. Yeah, you got it, Peanut. No! But not until the end of the summer. Lake Bottom seems like a great place. Oh, very family friendly. That's right. Hey, hey, maybe we should transfer you here. Think how much fun you'd have. No! Yeah, you know, I don't think she's ready to turn over a new leaf. <laughs> Dear Mom, road trip! All we need is a longer road! <laughs> Campers, snail mail! <laughs> I almost forgot this! Anything for me? You bet, Camper! Yes! <laughs> For you! Ooh! Thanks! What about me? What about me? What about me? What about me? <laughs> Away! I just hit the correspondence mother load! <laughs> Wait a sec. Wait one sec! This letter isn't for me, it's from me. Huh? So is this one. And this one! And this one! These are all letters I sent to my mom this summer, and they've all been sent back. That's weird, McGee. Why would all your letters be sent back? Oh, let's see. Poor penmanship, free stain letters, stanky spit on the stamp, stanky spit on the envelope. All valid points, Squirt. But I choose to jump to the most extreme conclusion. Something horrible happened to my parents! I have to find out if my folks are okay. Mom, Dad, I'm a coming! I think. Oh, what? I might as well bring my laundry. After I find my mom, she can wash all my dirty undies. Just use this and call him, okay? Huh? Huh? This frantically dialed cell phone is currently not in service. What, hello? Not in service? Why? Why? Why isn't there any service? Why? <laughs> You said you had an old-timey phone in here. Where is it? Found it. I think I hear a dial tone. <laughs> uh, that's not it, guys. This is it. No, Greg! Get your old-timey thing straight. That's an old-timey iron. This is an old-timey phone. Pick up, pick up, pick up. Come on, pick up. The customer you have dialed is not picking up. They didn't pick up! Please proceed to panic. Goodbye. Ah! What do we do now? If we can't contact your parents, McGee, we're gonna find out why. The Camp Lake Bottom Gang is going to McGee's house! Okay, gang, here's how it's gonna go down. As soon as the sun starts to set, we get on the camp bus. Then we drive the bus to McGee's town and find his parents. <gasps> no! Uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, who follows intricately orchestrated plans anyway? Now, as long as we're out before sunrise, the city folk won't know their town was full of monsters. Okay, the non-plan plan works for me. Let's do this. Okay in there? Fit as a fiddle. Thanks again for loaning me your suitcase, McGee. And a pile of dirty undies? So cozy. Hey! Can we get moving already? Uh, now to see if all my not a monster training paid off. <clears throat> bark. Bark, bark. Woof. <laughs> not bad, Armand. <laughs> Acting 
is my life. A beginner's guide to bus driving. <laughs> Every little bit helps. <laughs> See? Every little bit does help. Okay, everybody! Here we go! <laughs> Guys, I just wanted to say thanks. With all of us working together, I know nothing can go wrong. <laughs> Okay. Now here we go. <laughs> Just remember where we parked. <gasps> no, I cannot believe we're in the big city. This is so exciting. I know. There's so much to see. Ooh, a house. <gasps> Oh, paved roads. Yeah, paved roads are great, but I'm too worried about my parents to enjoy them. Oh, I hope they're okay. Focus, team, focus. We don't have much time to spare. We are a go for Operation Find McGee's parents. <clears throat> um. Uh, we are also a go for Operation Get Squirt a Souvenir. Now, before we deploy, does anyone need a number one release scenario? It's just cool mission talk for anyone need a pee break? <laughs> anyone see Sawyer? I hope he's not taking a pee break in my suitcase. That we left on the bus! <laughs> no! Sawyer! That was not part of my well-orchestrated plan! I've got this. <laughs> also, woof, 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 woof! <laughs> It was a wild ride. Oh, I could really use a number one release scenario. Um, anyone know where the parts of me are that do that? Phew, good thing Armand was able to stop the bus, huh? I hey, where is Armand anyway? Guys, you'll never believe the gig I just landed. I'm headlining the Dog Pound. Whatever that is. Hollywood, here I come. Campers. The coast is clear. Oh, this is so not cool. My parents could be in some serious jumping at the most extreme conclusion danger right now. Don't worry. I'm sure the extreme danger your parents are in will last till after we rescue Armand. Team, I got the perfect plan. Everyone say, rescue attempt. <laughs> is the perfect plan. Now let's do this! Huh, the door was unlocked the whole time. Come on, everyone. <coughs> I said, let's do this! <laughs> okay, team, prepare yourselves. Being in lockdown changes people and Sasquatches. <laughs> Gang, glad you could make it. Pull up a dirty pillow and join in. Armand, we gotta get you out. I'm not going anywhere. We're at a crucial point in our rehearsal. These dogs are going to be stars. Who wants a Tweety? Nom nom nom. Oh, showbiz is such a cruel mistress. One day you're surrounded by rabid dogs. The next day you're nothing. Oh. Wow, they are good. Okay, now can we find my folks? Uh, we're missing Squirt. <laughs> okay, so now can we find my pet? Hey, anyone see Rosebud? This plum rodent will be perfect for my special hot dog recipe. Come on, we must hurry. No, I am not leaving. I am going to be a hot dog millionaire. Guys, it's my house! Oh. <laughs> See? Oh, 
That's my hockey stick. Right there. I <laughs> and that's my scooter. Ow! <laughs> that's... Uh, that's my mom's. McGee, if this is your house, then why is the address on the letters different? See? The house address is 23 Generic Road, but the letter says 123 Generic Road. Yeah, that is weird. And... Huh? Okay. I forgot I took this address number along with me to camp as a keepsake. <laughs> so no wonder all these letters that my mom came back to me. <laughs> it's pretty funny, huh? And we are a stop on Operation Find McGee's Parents. That still doesn't explain why McGee's parents aren't even at home. I just love sunrises. Now back on the bus. Just need some breakfast first. <laughs> This must be McGee's cabin. Oh, he is going to be completely surprised to see us here. <laughs> Even if he never did send us one letter, maybe he didn't want us to visit him at camp. Oh, come on, sweetheart. Why wouldn't McGee want us to visit him at camp? Oh, look at the cute little chipmunk. Oh! Oh! Honey, do something! I learned something very important about my brain. I want to keep it. <laughs> hey, check it out. I'm weaving a hat out of lizard tails for my mom. Or not. Another pot holder for my mother. I made this for my mom. <laughs> Don't worry, Fluffy. I'll make you one later. <laughs> Your mommy's lucky to have kids like you. Oh, that reminds me, Sawyer. Can you mail this postcard to my mom? Sure. <laughs> hey, what's the matter, Zombuddy? <laughs> Got something in my eye. <laughs> Just keep loving your mamas. <laughs> Ew, he turned my pot holder into a snot holder. Hello? I just wanted to call and say hi. What? No, I'm not changing my mind, and I'm not moving back home. <laughs> What's up with Sawyer? No worries. It's a family thing. Never get involved with other people's family things. Hello? Oh, he can't come to the phone right now. <laughs> really? Great idea, sure. You got a pen? Gonna help Sawyer out with this family thing. Oh. <laughs> What's that? Young man. Wow! I can't believe you're already here. Sawyer's gonna be so surprised that you're... A zombie? Well, aren't you the smart one? Must be that big, juicy brain. Zombie Mom! Oh, where's the fire, campers? Zombie! <laughs> Mom, what are you doing here? My baby! How did you find me? Just trying to help. <laughs> You're welcome. Well, thanks for ruining my afterlife, Buttinsky. <laughs> Introduce me to your little feast. Uh, I have friends. Mom, these are my campers, who are not for snacking. Campers, this is my mother. Hi. Hi. Nice to eat you. <laughs> okay. Get you unpacked. Didn't exactly think the whole zombie mom thing through, did ya? Who'd have thunk a zombie's mom would be a zombie mom? Sorry I messed up, Sawyer. I thought you missed your mom. I did. I do. It's just my mom always treats me like a little kid. Plus, she's kind of crazy for... <laughs> ah! I haven't seen her since I gave up brains to run Camp Lake Bottom. Remember, keep your weapons close and your eyes open. You never know when she may strike! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Sweet dreams, campers. Great! How are we gonna survive the night with Zombie Mom wandering around with a bad case of the munchies? We let her know the snack bar is closed. I'll take guard duty. No one gets by Eagle Eye McGee. Hmm. Huh? Ah! Back, Undead Beast! I mean, Mrs. Undead Beast! Don't let him go! Time for breakfast! She seems nice. I like her, except for the brain-eating part. <laughs> Looks like someone's been messing with family business. McGee! <laughs> Mom, you can't just wander around trying to snack on my campers. Oh, don't be mad. I made your favorite cookies. <laughs> Ginger brainies. Ginger b, b brainies Well, I guess one couldn't hurt. <laughs> oh, don't you look precious. Who's mommy still a zombie? <laughs> I am. <laughs> I'll be in the kitchen sharpening my knives. Scream if you need me. <laughs> cool! I have the same sailor suit! Shh. I just want to take a peek. This is disturbing on so many levels. Don't you want to come home with Mommy? Mm, maybe, Mommy. Don't you want to eat ranch again? <gasps> well, I, um, sometimes. No, Mommy! Sawyer, don't listen to her! But she's my Mommy. I just want you to be happy. I'll eat brains. <laughs> is that so wrong? Hands off our buddy's brain! Are you gonna offer her a snack? It's all I could find. Oh. Let him go! All you're fighting is tearing me apart! I didn't mean McGee upset you, dear. That's okay. Mommy's going to tell you a dead time story. Yay! A story! Once upon a time, there was a good little zombie who loved his mommy, ate up all his brains, and grew big and strong. Brains! That's it, sweetie. Take a nice little dirt nap. Uh, I think it's time to go. No, Sawyer needs us. No, he needs his mommy. So, my sweet little undead boy's coming back home to be what he's meant to be. <laughs> that was a short nap. Brains! 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 I'm so proud of my song, boy. Now let's go get some brains! No, oh, I thought I'd never find my way home. Oh! Armand! Sawyer and his mom have gone full on zombie! It's a mom's apocalypse! It's a what? They want to eat our brains! Oh. To the mess hall! I'll hold them off! Brains! Rosebud, let us in! Password, please. Brains! Ah, that's it! One second! Brains! <laughs> Rosebud, now would be good. <gasps> it's a madhouse out there. Armand, um, how did you get in? The back door was open. Good thing too. Otherwise, I'd be stuck outside with those zombies. Not
Bottom, especially my counselor Sawyer. No, don't listen to him. <laughs> he keeps us more or less safe and makes every moment at Lake Bottom fun, fun, fun. Love McGee. Um, P.S. He doesn't eat brains, like ever. You, you wrote to your mom <laughs> about me. Oh. Sawyer, finish your brains or there's no dessert. <laughs> Do I lie awake at night dreaming of scooping out the camper's brains and eating them like ice cream? Sir, but I don't, because being a camp counselor is my true dream. And Camp Lake Bottom is my home now. And if you can't handle it, Mom, <laughs> just go! This is all your fault. You're a bad influence. <laughs> no, Mom, this is my choice. These little brains aren't for easy. <laughs> Please, Mommy. Okay, Johnny. What a great mom. Except for the brain eating part. Ah, uh, group hug. Or not. I'm good either way. <laughs> 